Many animals only care for their offspring for a short time, or not at all. In fact, most of us might think that humans are the most dedicated at raising their young, but you would be wrong. Many animals go to great lengths to ensure that their children grow up to be healthy, self-sufficient, and continue to carry on the species. This time, make sure you stick until the end of the video, because these animals will definitely surprise you. Cassilians are animals that look like earthworms, but are actually amphibians that live underground in most rainforests around the world. Their babies are fed by a fluid that the mother secretes from her cloaca. It sounds similar to the way most animal mothers feed their offspring, but these mothers take it to a whole other level. In fact, a Sicilian mother allows her infants to actually eat her skin. The skin is filled with essential nutrients and fats, and once eaten, the skin grows back every few days. This way, the babies don't completely consume the mother, and she is able to continue feeding them until they are dependent enough to forage on their own. Most fish species just lay their eggs and go on their merry way, but not these guys. Clownfish parents create a home for their young in an anemone. This way, the stinging anemone will help to protect the young fries. Additionally, the mucus coat all over these fish is the reason why they aren't harmed. Once the eggs are fertilized, a clownfish father would clean the eggs continuously for 10 days until they hatch. After hatching, both parents then fan the babies with their fins. This caring action supplies the young fries with a continuous flow of nutrient and oxygen. Strawberry poison dart frogs are truly adorable when raising their young. As a matter of fact, the parents have to work together. Once the fertilized eggs are laid on the rainforest floor, the father frog urinates on them to keep them constantly moistened. He also fights off any enemies that may come along. After hatching, the babies will actually try to eat each other, so the mother needs to carry them one by one on her back, up into the treetops, where she deposits them in their own little swimming hole. For 50 days, she keeps returning to each tadpole's pond. This is to deposit unfertilized eggs for the baby to eat until their maturity. Elephants are absolutely fascinating, and their dedication to their young is one of the reasons why. African elephants take the term, it takes a village to heart when it comes to their babies. They travel in herds of up to 70 females with one female matriarch. Not only that, after birth, the females gather around the new mother and encourage the calf to nurse. They even go so far as to nurse a calf that isn't their own. All of the females in the herd keeps an eye on each other's babies and will form a circle facing out with their young in the middle when threatened by an enemy. Even young elephants will help an infant climb a riverbank if needed. As a matter of fact, these mothers continue to care for their young for years until they reach teenage. Of all of the astonishing parents in the animal kingdom, the giant Pacific octopus is definitely one of the most shocking. It all starts how a female lays a clutch of eggs that can number in the hundreds of thousands. She then keeps a watch over them without even taking care of herself, fanning them with water to keep them clean and well oxygenated for six months or more until they hatch. Since she has to continuously do this to keep them alive, she doesn't eat or rest the entire time. Once the eggs hatch, the mother octopus usually ends up dying from exhaustion and malnutrition. <laughs>